10 miles north of Allentown, Pennsylvania, on State Route 145, across the Lehigh River, is the cozy little village of Triclers. Situated in Northampton County, the town is named after Henry Trichler. Off Blue Mountain Drive is a tiny little street called Breadfruit Drive. To the casual observer, it's just an abandoned dead end, but to the rail fan, there's something more going on. The now out-of-service Mauser Mill is located here. The five-story roller mill originally drew water to power its turbine from the Lehigh Canal. In 1891, the mill contained one Victor brush in the basement, seven sets of rolls, two run of stone, and one Silver Creek smutter on the first floor, two flower packers and four purifiers on the second floor, and three chests and a brand duster in the attic. The mill was originally built by Berlin F. Bow as Franklin Mills in 1871, but the story begins even further back than that. David Kuntz established the mill in 1794 and the town was called Kuntzford. When Henry Trichler became the owner of the Kuntz Mill, the town became known as Trichlers. In 1862, Jacob Mauser established a grain mill that became one of the largest grist mills in the Northeast. Mauser also had a mill in Laurie Station and on Canal Street in Northampton. The firm was recognized for Mauser's Best Flour, a staple on the shelves of many former neighborhood stores. Both the Laurie's Mill and the Northampton Mill were destroyed by fire, but its flagship mill here in Triclers was operated by the Mauser family from 1882 until the late 1960s. In the 1970s, it became a part of ConAgra Grain Processing, the large Midwest milling conglomerate of then Omaha, Nebraska. ConAgra is a worldwide company with plants all over, including this one in Milton, Pennsylvania. And if those ConAgra covered hoppers look familiar to you, they should. They were a common sight on the now abolished trains 10A and 11A. ConAgra is also the parent company of Lamb Weston, who we talked about in America's Coolest Trains. ConAgra used the mill to grind oat flowers until 2014. After that, the landmark mill closed and the milling era ended in the village. So why are we here? Triclers used to be a stop for the Central Railroad of New Jersey. If you're hip to Northeastern Railroad history, then you may know that the CNJ departed Pennsylvania in 1972, ceding its Pennsylvania rail operations to the Lehigh Valley Railroad. The valley was folded into Conrail in 1976, and this stretch of track became part of Conrail's Lehigh Line. Conrail was split between Norfolk Southern and CSX in 1999, giving NS ownership of the line. Since Conrail's formation in 1976, the Delaware and Hudson has had trackage rights over the Lehigh Line, which was inherited by the Canadian Pacific when they took over the DNH in 1991. CP ran several trains a day over the Lehigh Line, including what NS classified as the 39Z, which we can see here moving northbound past the mill on April 30, 2010. Those loaded trash gondolas at the front of the train and the intermodal containers are an easy indication that this train originated in Oak Island, New Jersey. Note the Burlington Northern hopper spotted on the siding and another covered hopper spotted at the mill. <laughs> 